All right, let's uh, check on other markets. Uh, not looking as good as what's happening um, on the NGX. That we see Bitcoin started a downside correction after it failed to clear the 28,500 uh, resistance. And we see a big uh, 2.60 drop there, $27,046. Um, that's what we're seeing for uh, the price of Bitcoin this morning. Ethereum, $1,861, also down about 2.04%. Uh, BNB, uh, getting to that shaky $300 level. Uh, down 1.83 percent and we see uh, Cardano down 1.43 percent but on the flip side XRP still looking strong um, right now 51 cent up 2.36 uh, percent seem to be they seem to be scoring points uh, against the US SEC um, at this time but that's why we're seeing XRP still looking strong some analysts expect that this uh, might actually continue this uh, bullish run uh, for what we're seeing but it, it depends on what happens uh, with that case are we going to hear uh, that the XRP has won the case against the SEC that would be quite incredible all right so another issue now hacks a, a common occurrence in the um, crypto um, industry and uh, some um, uh, protocols get exploited you know at this time and uh, right here in Nigeria a leading uh, cryptocurrency platform did get hacked for about two million um, dollars let's talk to uh, local worker now Denny a financial market analyst and crypto evangelist great to have you on the show thank you great to have you uh, good morning so yeah th these hacks are becoming a common uh, a common in this uh, crypto industry with uh, protocols getting exploited is this uh, does this bring that argument about self custody is that the answer um, to these um, hacks because the customers suffer when the platforms get hacked yeah um, self, self, um, self, self custody is very important in the crypto space because you are able to hold your crypto in your personal wallet without having issues with centralized exchanges. I think we've had a lot of high profile hacks with centralized exchanges of recent, and I think this is the latest. And it also serves as a reminder for companies and organizations to have robust and comprehensive security measures put in place to protect their customers. And definitely, it's not easy being your own bank because uh, if you lose your keys to your wallets you know <laughs> when you um hold some of these cryptocurrencies you lose your keys you have no access to your money you know anymore so it's still a difficult uh, bit that being your own bank isn't it yes it's quite difficult and that's why we have the popularity of centralized exchanges that come up and help people where you can recover your password but at the end of the day, I believe that education is very important and having multiple places where you're able to keep your private keys is one of the steps towards ensuring that you have your personal keys to yourself. Because if you look at it in the past six months, we've seen the fall of FTX due to the financial mismanagement. We've heard of so many crypto exchanges either having high profile hacks or we have seen a lot of security breaches in the crypto space. The best way is still holding your crypto in your personal wallet. Yeah, and, and keeping your keys very safe, which is not easy, you know, at this time. But thank you so much, uh, Lord Porku, uh, Denny. Thank you for your perspective today. Thank you. All right, let's uh, see what's happening with Top Gain and Sequan topping our counter up 3.09%. Um, GRT, the graph, 2.24%. XRP also, you know, coming up on the Top Gainers counter. Um, AGIX, that's um, up about 2.08%. So we're seeing a downtrend um, right now in the market, but that's where we have uh, single digit gains. Uh, the biggest loser this morning, uh, IOTA, 10.90% down. And uh, the new MIM coin, a uh, new kid on the block there, down 7.26%. On profit taken on that, we see Kava also on that list down 7.03%. Um, All right, uh, that's a wrap on the program, and that's how the market is looking today. Don't forget, join us at 1.30 on Business Incorporated for more updates and developments in the world of business. Remember, you can watch this again on our YouTube channel. Just flip over to YouTube, search for channels, television, uh, check out videos, and you can watch all our production. Thank you for watching. I'm Ladi Williams. Bye for now.